What's up, toy fans? It's that time again. It's Ben from Bugsy's Toy Box. What's up, toy fans? We're back. Another video. We've been busy with our online toy shows, um, but thought we'd stop and sort of take time to do another video. Uh, I'm going to be putting some more shelves and some bits and pieces that I've been picking up over the last sort of few weeks slash months uh, into the collection. I got sort of that mess behind me out. Add some new shelves and stuff in, so thought I'd bring you guys along for the ride. So, I uh, hope you enjoy. So guys, as you can see, all the cabinets are empty. Really nice, uh, really nice, really good excuse to have a dust. Uh, so next up, it's time to put in some of these. Now, these were a recommendation of our good friend Andy from Andy's Toy Bin. Um, they are, if you see all my other, it's surprising, on a side note, how much stuff you can fit into just a couple of cabinets. Got a set of these, as you saw from uh, Aaron from Empire Toys 1138's latest video. He's got a set of these as well. Um, they come with all these sort of 3D printed um, clips and clasps. I'm going to be popping them in. I think I'm going to do all of them at the same level on the, the bottom, oh, second to bottom section. So, here we go. Right guys, as you can see, there it is. First shelf is in, nice and level. Uh, it's a little bit fiddly to try and get in. You've got these, as you can see here, these little clips, uh, and they've got a bolt that drops in. I don't know whether we can see it that side. The sort of bolt drops in this this little um, hole here on the right, uh, and the screw goes in, or the bolt goes in that side, sorry, the nut goes in that side, and it pinches it together, but there's no way to stop the nut spinning in this little hole. So I've had to pop a screwdriver in either side to sort that out. But it's all in. Split that shelf nicely. As you saw, I was measuring it up against my Toxic Crusaders so I can sit the vehicles at the bottom, sit the figures at the top. So that should be all good. Now, time to do the other two. Right, guys, as you can see, my three shelves are in. I only time-lapsed the first one, uh, as these are quite tricky to get in, um, and thought, you guys don't want to sit and watch me struggling. So it's now time to fill. Right, just in case any of you guys were wondering what I was using for shelf risers, it's these um, shelf risers from Wilco. They're only about four quid, find them in the kitchen section. And as you can see, because I can get it right in this take and not try and put them into a closed door cabinet, they fit quite nicely onto the shelves. Right guys, and there you have it. There is the first shelf filled up with my new, almost complete Toxic Crusaders line. So, so, so awesome. Right, I'm gonna carry on filling the cases. So back to the time lapse in.
guys, thanks for watching. That's it's all done and dusted, literally. Uh, as you can see behind me, everything is now nicely in the cases. Excuse the glare from the big uh, studio light and all the rubbish in the corner. Uh, but thank you for watching. Um, Mugsy is going to do another sale soon, so keep your eyes peeled on our Instagram and Facebook channel for that. Um, as always, guys, stay safe, keep it unpunched, and thanks for watching.